Hello everyone, and this is Jeff Ogden, the president of Find New Customers, back with another weekly show of Laugh and Learn with Find New Customers. And for those of you who are regular viewers, we changed the title slightly because our graphics designer made up a new show logo and he put in Find New Customers instead of Fearless Comp, which is our Twitter ID. Oh, no big deal. We'll just change the name of the show. <laughs> Not a big deal. So anyway, uh, before we go into what we're going to talk about this week, I need to take a moment and just reflect on what we did last week. It was the show with the shoes. And it was touching with just haunting music, and it was a beautiful piece. And I'm, I'm so proud of it, and it just epitomizes our feeling at Find New Customers, which is always be helping, which is go out of your way and do things to help other people. It's so important today, especially in this terrible economy, keep looking for opportunities to help other people, and the world comes to your door. So I think that's such a great lesson from last week. So if you haven't seen it, go back to August 19th, that Friday, and look at Laugh and Learn, Episode 40, Always Be Helping. In this week, we're going to go back to a tried and true one, which is the classic Did It Blend. It's these guys at Blendtec who make these industrial blenders, and they... One of the items I, that are so popular today is an iPad, and they decide they will it blend. I'm going to be back and talk about marketing takeaways from it, so watch this. Hello, ladies. How are you? Fantastic. Does your man look like me? No. Could he blend like me? Yes. Should he use a Blendtec blender? I don't know. You tell me. Look at your blender. Now look at mine. Now back at your blender. Now back to mine. See the difference? Look down, back up, where are you? You're on the set of Will It Blend with the man your man could blend like. Doing the moonwalk backwards. I'm in a lab coat. Okay, okay, we get the picture. For today's episode, we're going to blend a bottle of Old Spice. Look at my hand, now back to me. I have it. It isn't fruits or vegetables, but a little something for your blending man is pleasure. Look again, this is what happens after coming face to face with a Blendtec photo blender. I know, we've done this already. Old Spice bottle left hand catch. Give me that. Swan dive. Into the strongest blender this side of Jupiter. That was my line. Mm -hmm. I've got glasses. I've got gloves. I'm gonna press the smoothie button. smoke. You can breathe this like a man's man. And yes, it blends. We're back. And so what is the marketing takeaway from, uh, from Will It Blend? And I think there's a couple. One is get the audience involved. Let the audience make suggestions about what should go in the blender. That's one lesson. I think the other one is shock and surprise. These guys are in lab coats, and they're, you know, they're kind of making, having fun with it. So, you know, and they're doing things that are shocking. And that's, that excitement really makes a difference in B2B marketing. So, as I like to say, let your freak flag fly. Have fun, have a great weekend, and we'll see you next week. This is Jeff Ogden, the president of Fine New Customers.